Hello and welcome back. Today we are going through all 100 civics questions for the U.S. Citizenship Test using easy to remember answers, but this time we're going to do it in random order. I will repeat the questions and answers two times. Let's get started. What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? What are two rights of everyone living in the United States? Freedom of speech. Freedom of religion. Freedom of speech. Freedom of religion. In what month do we vote for president? In what month do we vote for president? November. November. What are two cabinet level positions? What are two cabinet level positions? Secretary of Defense. Secretary of Education, Secretary of Defense, Secretary of Education. What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? What ocean is on the west coast of the United States? The Pacific Ocean. The Pacific Ocean. Who was the first president? Who was the first president? George Washington. George Washington. What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? What is the name of the Speaker of the House of Representatives now? Can what is one reason colonists came to America? What is one reason colonists came to America? For freedom. Freedom. What is an amendment? What is an amendment? It's a change to the Constitution. A change to the Constitution. What is the name of the national anthem? What is the name of the national anthem? The Star Spangled Banner. The Star Spangled Banner. Who was president during World War I? Who was president during World War I? Woodrow Wilson. Wilson. What did the Declaration of Independence do? What did the Declaration of Independence do? It said that the United States is free. It said that the United States is free. Why does the flag have 50 stars? Why does the flag have 50 stars?
because there is one star for each state. Because there is one star for each state. Who makes federal laws? Who makes federal laws? Congress. Congress. What is freedom of religion? What is freedom of religion? You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. You can practice any religion or not practice a religion. Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the states. What is one power of the states? To provide schooling and education. To provide schooling and education. How many U.S. Senators are there? How many U.S. Senators are there? One hundred. One hundred. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Name one of the two longest rivers in the United States. Missouri River. The Missouri River. The House of Representatives has how many voting members? The House of Representatives has how many voting members? Four hundred thirty five. Four hundred thirty five. What does the Constitution do? What does the Constitution do? It sets up the government. Sets up the government. We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? We elect a U.S. Senator for how many years? Six. Six. Six years. Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Why do some states have more representatives than other states? Because of the state's population. Because of the state's population. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1900s. World War Two. World War Two. How many amendments does the Constitution have? How many amendments does the Constitution have? Twenty seven. 27. We elect a president for how many years? 
We elect a president for how many years? Four. Four years. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Name one American Indian tribe in the United States. Crow. Crow. Name one branch or part of the government. Name one branch or part of the government. Congress. Congress. Name your U.S. representative. Name your U.S. representative. Answers here will vary. You'll need to go to house.gov and type in your zip code on the top of the page. Then you'll need to type in your address to find your specific representative. Okay. So that's based on your address. What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? What are two rights in the Declaration of Independence? Life and liberty. Life and liberty. If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If both the president and the vice president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The Speaker of the House. The Speaker of the House. What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? What is one right or freedom from the First Amendment? Speech. Speech. What are the two major political parties in the United States? What are the two major political parties in the United States? Democrat and Republican. Democrat and Republican. Who vetoes bills? Who vetoes bills? The president, the president. What is the name of the president of the United States now? What is the name of the president of the United States now? Joe Biden, Joe Biden. What ocean is on the east coast of the United States? What ocean is on the east coast? of the United States. The Atlantic Ocean. The Atlantic Ocean. What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? What did the Emancipation Proclamation do? It freed the slaves. Freed the slaves. What does the judicial branch do? What does the judicial branch do? It reviews laws. Reviews laws. 
There were 13 original states. Name three. There were 13 original states. Name three. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. New Hampshire, New York, New Jersey. Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Who is one of your state's U.S. Senators now? Answers here will vary depending where you live. Every state has two senators. You only need to remember one. Please go to senate.gov to find your senators. Choose your state and then the easiest name for you to remember. When was the Constitution written? When was the Constitution written? Seventeen eighty seven. Seventeen eighty seven. What major event happened on September eleventh, two thousand one, in the United States? What major event happened on September 11, 2001, in the United States? Terrorists attacked the United States. Terrorists attacked the United States. What is the capital of the United States? What is the capital of the United States? Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C. How many justices are on the Supreme Court? How many justices are on the Supreme Court? Nine. Nine justices. The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? The idea of self-government is in the first three words of the Constitution. What are these words? We the people. We the people. What does the president's cabinet do? What does the president's cabinet do? It advises the president. Advises the president. Under our constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? Under our Constitution, some powers belong to the federal government. What is one power of the federal government? To print money. To print money. What is the rule of law? What is the rule of law? Everyone must follow the law. Everyone must follow the law. What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803? What territory did the United States buy from France in 1803. Louisiana. Louisiana. 
Who is the governor of your state now? Who is the governor of your state now? The answers will vary here as well. You're going to go to usa.gov slash state dash governor to choose your state to find the name of your governor. Who is in charge of the executive branch? Who is in charge of the executive branch? The president. The president. When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? When is the last day you can send in federal income tax forms? April 15th. April 15th. What is the capital of your state? What is the capital of your state? Answers will vary depending on your state or territory or if you live in the district. Answers will vary here. Okay. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Name one problem that led to the Civil War. Slavery. Slavery. What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? What are the two parts of the U.S. Congress? The Senate and House. The Senate and House. What is the supreme law of the land? What is the supreme law of the land? The Constitution. The Constitution. Who is the commander in chief of the military? Who is the commander in chief? of the military. The president. The president. What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? What did Martin Luther King Jr. do? He fought for civil rights. He fought for civil rights. Why did the colonists fight the British? Why did the colonists fight the British? Because of high taxes. Because of high taxes. What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? What stops one branch of government from becoming too powerful? Checks and balances. Checks and balances. Where is the Statue of Liberty? Where is the Statue of Liberty? New York. In New York. What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens? What is one responsibility that is only for United States citizens.
to vote in a federal election. Vote in a federal election. We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? We elect a U.S. representative for how many years? Two. Two years. Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? Who is the Chief Justice of the United States now? John Roberts. John Roberts. When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? When was the Declaration of Independence adopted? July 4th, 1776. July 4th, 1776. Name one right only for United States citizens. Name one right only for United States citizens. Vote in a federal election. Vote in a federal election. Name one state that borders Canada. Name one state that borders Canada. New York. New York. What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? What is one promise you make when you become a United States citizen? To obey the laws of the United States. Obey the laws of the United States. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. Name the U.S. war between the North and the South. The Civil War. The Civil War. How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? How old do citizens have to be to vote for president? Eighteen and older. Eighteen and older. What movement tried to end racial discrimination? What movement tried to end racial discrimination? Civil rights. Civil Rights Movement. When must all men register for the Selective Service? When must all men register for the Selective Service? At age 18. At age 18. Name two national U.S. holidays. Name two national U.S. holidays. New Year's Day and President's Day. New Year's Day and President's Day. Who lived in America before the Europeans arrived? 
who lived in America before the Europeans arrived. American Indians American Indians Name one U.S. territory. Name one U.S. territory. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? What group of people was taken to America and sold as slaves? Africans. Africans. Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Who was president during the Great Depression and World War II? Franklin Roosevelt. Roosevelt. Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Who wrote the Declaration of Independence? Thomas Jefferson, or just Jefferson. What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? What was one important thing that Abraham Lincoln did? He freed the slaves. Freed the slaves. What is the political party of the president now? What is the political party of the president now? He is in the Democratic Party. Joe Biden is in the Democratic Party. What happened at the Constitutional Convention? What happened at the Constitutional Convention? The Constitution was written. The Constitution was written. What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? What do we call the first 10 amendments to the Constitution? The Bill of Rights. The Bill of Rights. During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? During the Cold War, what was the main concern of the United States? Communism. Communism. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. The Federalist Papers supported the passage of the U.S. Constitution. Name one of the writers. John Jay. Jay. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. Name one war fought by the United States in the 1800s. The Civil War. The Civil War. 
When do we celebrate Independence Day? When do we celebrate Independence Day? July 4th. July 4th. Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? Before he was president, Eisenhower was a general. What war was he in? World War II. World War II. Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Why does the flag have 13 stripes? Because there were 13 original colonies. Because there were 13 original colonies. What did Susan B. Anthony do? What did Susan B. Anthony do? She fought for civil rights. Fought for civil rights. Name one state that borders Mexico. Name one state that borders Mexico. California. California. Who signs bills to become laws? Who signs bills to become laws? The president. The president. Who did the United States fight in World War II? Who did the United States fight in World War II? Japan, Germany, and Italy. Japan, Germany, and Italy. What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? What is one thing Benjamin Franklin is famous for? He was a U.S. diplomat. A U.S. diplomat. What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? What do we show loyalty to when we say the Pledge of Allegiance? The United States. The United States. Who does a U.S. Senator represent? Who does a U.S. Senator represent? All people of the state. All people of the state. What is the economic system in the United States? What is the economic system in the United States? It's a capitalist economy. A capitalist economy. If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? If the president can no longer serve, who becomes president? The vice president. The vice president. 
Who is the father of our country? Who is the father of our country? George Washington. George Washington. What are two ways that Americans can participate in their democracy? What are two ways Americans can participate in their democracy? Vote and join a political party. Vote and join a political party. What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? What is the name of the Vice President of the United States now? Kamala Harris. Kamala Harris. There are four amendments to the Constitution about who can vote. Describe one of them. There are four amendments to the Constitution about Kamala who can Harris. Vote. Kamala Describe Harris. Describe one of them. Citizens 18 and older can vote. Citizens 18 and older can vote. What is the highest court in the United States? What is the highest court in the United States? The Supreme Court. The Supreme Court. And there you have it, all 100 questions for the civics portion of the U.S. Citizenship Test. Congratulations on making it through. If you'd like this video, please give it a quick thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Let me know if you have any questions or comments right below and I'll try to get back to you. Thanks for watching and see you next time.